So this video was sponsored by Virtuous, the creators of Carbon Warfare, an absolutely insane game which I'm about to show you guys right now but I want to throw it out there. Bear in mind all sponsored videos that I do create, all opinions etc are all my own. I can say anything about this game but what you see is generally how I feel about the game and I want to promote everything that I find super cool so I hope you enjoy this video. This is what a bad plan of, of taking over the world and screwing it over really really means okay. Hey guys and welcome your lovely face back to another video. Now you guys know I am such a huge fan of, of mobile game. Today ladies and gentlemen, I have a game as you can see in the background called Carbon Warfare. Now I'm going to start a brand new game just so we can go over things and so forth. Now this to me is such a unique game so I'm going to run for everything. So basically your aim in this game is to be the bad guy. Your job is to destroy the entire world. Now that sounds crazy as it is, right? This guy you see on screen right now, this is the bad freaking guy, okay? This is the guy you don't really want to be, but you gotta be in this game because you're a bad motherfucker. So the time has come, he has guaranteed your wealth and your power. Now you have to repay him, pretty much in a nutshell, okay? Skipping all this for Jiggle Wiggles out, we're gonna destroy the damn world, <laughs> in a nutshell. You invest in stuff, okay? So we're gonna get straight into it. As you can see, uh, well I should probably go straight into the invest button just to get you guys, you know, like a brief, brief insight. So you can see, invest in North America in the right here. It's a rich ass place, destroy it, you get some money, okay? So we're gonna invest in this place. So we're gonna do the carbon emissions. Obviously that's gonna increase, but so will people's awareness of global warning. So you kinda wanna, well, in terms of them noticing it, it it's a bad thing. Cause then they're obviously, you know, gonna, gonna try and stop it. Or are they? See, that, that's the twist in this game. But you want to be the badass guy and just destroy shit without anyone being able to do shit. So as you can see, we've just invested. Now here you can see we have, I think this one is New York, if I'm not mistaken. It is New York. There you go. I'm, I'm a smart guy, man. So as you can see, the temperature has risen to the thermometer, you know, on, on the right hand side. Or you can see on the, on the hint section, the temperatures have risen, but it's not enough. So we need to invest again. Now we're still going to go for the, you know, normal carbon emissions. We're going to go for houses, etc, etc. Uh, but there are vehicles and so forth, which I will show you guys in a second. But let's invest into this one. And now you can see we got the electric station. I think that is. Uh, we got more houses and we got vehicles. And of course, that's just going to go further and further and further. So as you can see, industry, single family housing. So pretty much homes with extravagant energy needs and not a care for carbon footprints. That's why our, that's well, that's what our plans need. Here we should get coins. So the coins represent the amount of profit you gain from your investment in that region. Now bear in mind, the more badass you are, the more you're gonna increase the temperatures and so forth. You're gonna get the money, all right? And of course, it's gonna be more beneficial to you in the long run, which I'll show you guys as we go further on. Um, this is obviously the Middle East, I'm assuming. It might, might not be like, so don't take my word for anything. Now I'm gonna go for cars, obviously, because there's a lot of freaking cars. We're gonna invest in this and we should get 52 back. So let's get into that. And then of course, we can go straight into that. Um, or we can even invest into this. So I might invest into this. And that is it. I've got nothing at the minute now. Um, but let's close it. And as soon as the coins come up, and here we go, everything should be good. So we want to make sure we collect all this stuff. Because you know what? We want to destroy the world, you know? We want we want to go to world disaster, which is crazy. This, I mean, it's, it's such a good game. For me personally... Like, when, when I saw the concept of this game, I was like, you know what, I have to play this game. I just have to. It's just it's just one of those things that you're like, wow, you know, the, the concept to it, the idea to the whole game, it's actually quite interesting. I, I'm really, really, I really, really took to it, to be to be completely honest with you guys. Uh, the huge demand for wood products from all those new buildings. So I think that would be good to invest in, because then we're going to pretty much take down all the trees and so forth. So everything's getting a little crazy now. So now that look at that, holy shit! <laughs> we are we are really causing an issue here. Global temperatures up by two degrees. Uh, might not seem like a lot, but your climate has already become unstable and vulnerable to disaster. Let's continue. So as you can see, guys, we have just headed onto world disaster. <laughs> we have literally. 
Holy crap, we've done it, bro. You now have the power to control natural disasters caused by increased temperatures. So this is cool. We can cause whatever we want. So the highlighted area shows the potential disaster zones. So what's this? I assume this is all obviously the forest. Uh, disasters not only destroy the area, but they also have a chance to spread to nearby areas. So if that's going to... Well, this is near New York, so that should go straight to LA pretty much. So tap here to turn the buildup of hot air into devastating forest fire. And would you take a look at that? Wow. This is such a cool game, man. <laughs> Holy crap. Wow, I'm not I'm not gonna lie like I knew this game was gonna be cool But the ability to cause your own disasters that it just makes it so much more fun um, Okay, so the scientists are onto us the carbon capture project is a threat to my plans I trust you will not let it succeed. All right. Okay, so they've lost that we have pretty much destroyed everything right here So let's grab all the money. We want to make sure we get all this stuff. We want to get everything. Okay, Everything is the way to go. This is 2050. On, on a serious note, you know, I kind of hope this is not going to be how how America will be in 2050. So here we are. What is this? Carbon capture program 100%. Raise temperature to 19 degrees. Destroy all major cities. Undermine CCP with media. Right. We didn't get those two checkboxes, but we lost that. Humanity has overcome the climate. Fuck. I think I now know not what to do. Right, but this time, we, we now have the ability to go everywhere, which is freaking cool. Madrid, Paris, everywhere. Bro, we, we got a whole bunch of shit to destroy. Um, So, so we got different things here. So we got the awareness. Media, coal is clean. So let's invest into that. We don't really want them to have the awareness um, in terms of, you know, the global warming. That is what basically stops them. So keep the mercury rising by investing in more high carbon industries. The first one was obviously a trial. So now we know how it can defeat us, which is good. That's really good because I, I may have not figured that out by myself. Invest in corresponding industries to meet people's demand and reap the extra profit. Ah, I see, I see. Okay, you know what? Let's just invest in some freaking sheep. Let's, let's do it. Right. Wait, where the hell are we? We, we ended up in America. What? We, America? We ended up in freaking Australia. Holy shit. Now we're tackling two countries at the same time? That, that, that's some crazy shit right there. I mean... <laughs> We are literally going for world disaster right now. Let's invest here. So what's this? We want to make the awareness go down, which is freaking good. This is what I like. No point investing yet. Um, I mean, if I feel like I should invest, but then a part of me tells me I shouldn't. Let's just... Oh, I tell you what. Let's invest in this, and then we're going to invest in that. School. What's going on here? These have got more people. All right. Yes. Okay, so more people are moving down to here. If I, if I think that is what I'm seeing, that would make sense. This is a good day. This is a good day to destroy the freaking world, man. Oh, look at that little part. Where's it gone? That is destroyed. <laughs> Wellington is about to be non-existent. I screw up a lot of things, but now it's, it's actually a good thing. It's actually a good thing to screw up things. <laughs> Why did I... Why did I not click that? All this time, I've been waiting for the, for the disasters to just pop up. Okay, forest fires have to be the best. Um, but going in terms of size, I mean, they're both probably the same size. Well, no. Nah, this one's probably bigger. Let's go. <laughs> there you go. Let's go into that. Now, now we're talking, you know. Now, now we're really getting into it. Uh, let's get crops. We want to burn everything. Holy shit. This really is it. Everything is going... Oh, shit. That's gone. Is that pretty much gone? Holy... Oh, we can start a war as well. Oh, my God. Vancouver is destroyed. 32. I mean, that's our first one done. Holy shit. Right, 36 we're going to need. Uh, to bring the awareness down, we're going to need 47. And that's going to be very, very key. We don't want that to get any further. I mean, if it does get further, it's not the end of the world. <laughs> What a, what a great time to say that, because it pretty much is right now in this game. I still got my disaster stuff. So I tell you what, let's get rid of this part here, because that will go straight to Mexico, as you can see. Oh, and everything's traveling here. So that's coming in. Oh my god, I'm, I'm freaking destroying everything right now. Vancouver is a KO. Uh, let's get the forest here. That's going to make that go. Now, everything is becoming a lot harder. Um, if we go here and we take... Oh, shit. Wrong forest. I got one more. I got one more. Let's take out that one. There we are. That was a smart investment. That was a smart freaking investment. This is it. We're literally about to take South America out. Like, freaking out of the world. Right, so this is how iron and everything's going. Um, 
I mean, that's gonna be well profit-wise. Actually, I should have I should have invested in that. Increased damage from disasters. Yeah. Uh, okay, about that. And we can invest in this one. So carbon emissions again. Let's go into more. Now the awareness is increasing a slight bit. Take a look at what your boy has done to this section of the world. You see that little smoke here? This is all done by me. This is pretty much out, anyways. Right, let's take out that. This has got to be it. Surely. Surely got to be it. Come on. You know what? I might as well just chuck in one more. Uh, What else can we do? Oh, we can increase that. There we are. That's it. Oh, there we are. That was a war. That is definitely gone. Denver is destroyed, ladies and gentlemen. Now we've got Los Angeles, New York, and Mexico City. We're going to make it go now. It's going to make a war. Look at all those minuses. Wait, so are these people dying? Or what exactly is this? Oh, wait. Hold up. I didn't check out the awareness. Wait, more people are going to be moving to different countries, right? So the closest would probably be this one. Um, okay, we need to we need to change the awareness. So that's... Okay, there we are. Minus that. There we go. What a good freaking investment. That was definitely worth it. Now we can make the awareness all the way down. All the people go away. And that should be a KO. A K freaking O. Uh, Mexico City. Well, we're going to start a war for that real soon. In half an hour... I've managed to take out an entire, like, continent, pretty much. Holy crap. That's it. North America's done. North America is done. Oh, my God. That is scary, bro. What a game, man. What a game. I'm just sitting here. I I'm literally destroying the world at home. What? <laughs> I may have just potentially screwed this up big time. If I was to ever take over the world, just, just know you're safe because I'd never be able to succeed, guys. So, <laughs> if we learn one thing from this video. That's exactly... Or what we have just learned. This is what a bad plan of, of taking over the world and screwing it over really, really means, okay? Take take it from me. Don't, don't bother doing it. It's a waste of freaking time, okay? Oh, look at that. Oh, wait. Isn't that a good... That is a good thing. Population. That's going to screw up a lot of things. I just want to take out this whole side, you know? Let's make another disaster here. And there you are. Start a war. And that's done. That's what I like to see. That's pretty much the whole left side. The whole South America gone. North America gone. South America gone. Gun, non-existent. In the meantime, probably should take over of, over Australia as well. Just just for the bants, pretty much. So there you go. <laughs> so in the meantime, when you guys to get in the comment section below, let me know what you think of this game. I think it's an absolutely amazing game, but do use the link in the description below. It's available for both iOS and Android, so you, you can't really complain, you know. No matter what, what what device you have, you can still take over the world. You ain't got no freaking excuse, bro. So go and do it. The link is in the description below. It's time to take out Wellington as well. Are you ready for this? 3, 2, I mean, there's no 3, 2, 1. There's no 3, 2, 1. Goodbye, motherfucker. Wellington destroyed. It's one of those games that you, you think you won't be addicted to. You'll look at it and you'll be like, oh, this looks like a cool game, but I'm not going to be addicted to it. And then you're addicted to it, so... That's the game in a nutshell. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video anyway. Show sure subscribe if you haven't already. But I'll catch you guys in the next one. But till then, I hope you have a freaking amazing day. And adios amigos.